Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a new video. I hope you're doing fantastic. Smash the subscribe up. God damn it. I mean, subscribe if you're brand new. What it do, Flight Pro? FTC? Flight Team Steering up! Hey! Cash! No way! This day <laughs> has finally come. It says the title right here, Cash finally met LeBron James. Yes, sir. Guys, is this clickbait? Nah. Find out, man. Now, before I start, what I do know ahead of time, I believe like about a week. Dude, this is like my first ever flight video. If you guys are, if you guys love flight, make sure you subscribe right now. A week now. or two ago, um, like Rage and Kai was on stream, right? And so basically Kai, he had like a stream collab with like LeBron's manager, um, which was very, very interesting too. Like I didn't even know like that, how, how did that even like happen? But basically your Rage called in and completely W man's he mentioned cash and it like cash to uh, LeBron's manager, Rich Paul. And basically they was going to like set up a play. So like LeBron can, you know what I'm saying? Me cash and everything like that. And this was like about like a week or two ago. Uh, but like, I didn't think it really happened because like we've been waiting for like the video and here it is. So let's see what happens. Yeah. Dude, that must be a really special moment to meet LeBron James, bro. That guy is like the best. At least right now, he's like the best. Basketball player, it's almost like meeting Cristiano Ronaldo, you know what I'm saying? Or meeting, like, I say, who's the best, who's the best, like, athlete on the planet? Like, meeting Usain Bolt, like, meeting the best athlete, like, in any sport, you know what I'm saying? So, this guy is, like, the GOAT. He's got, like, over 200 million followers on Instagram, you know what I'm saying? So, that's why I love this guy. I see him. I'm pretty sure it was, like, six foot six. Video today. The NBA is flying me out to my first Memphis Grizzly game, and guess what? It's gonna be the first game that I play the Lakers. A huge shout out to the Memphis Grizzlies for hooking me up with this opportunity to see God, how, damn, their fans and see that, how crazy their fans are in the arena. So we're gonna see right now when we get to the arena. Hi right, y'all, so just got the plane. We just got done coming from California. The NBA is flying me out to Memphis. Uh, we lost our luggage because we don't know what time our luggage is going to be there because we came too damn late. It's a 45 minute cut off here. You can come uh, after that. They take your luggage if you want to. Shit, nigga, need a shave, man. You know what I'm saying? What is that? <laughs> That layover across like bro, west to east coast is crucial. Bro, that lady. Have my luggage on. That's what is flight drinking, man. This is yours. We're lean, man. You never know this nigga. Woo, that Max, let's go. <laughs> That's nice, man. I like those green ones. It's all Gucci. <laughs> <laughs> it's all Louis, man. Why is this nigga using Gucci? This is all we need, bro. Guys, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I had not been straight, you know? I didn't have to feel like a cash. You probably never did these videos, bro. I'm really not. I'm really trying to meet this nigga. I'm 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 trying to meet this nigga. Lucky, that looks nice, man. I'm trying to cut right now, though. You know what I'm saying? But that looks good. Back to the stuff over here, man. Damn, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. Bro, that's one thing, bro, about, like, Southern food, bro. Ain't nothing top of Southern food, bro. From I don't know, man. You know what I'm saying? You gotta come like, to Australia. Like, Carolinas, Memphis, Georgia, to Florida, to Texas, bro. You don't have the best natural cut food, like, where, 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 where anything. What if you come to Australia? You might change your mind, my nigga. You, you know, know what I'm saying? saying? I don't know. Comment down below. What, what, um... Is it the West, East, or the South who have the best food, bro? I can just tell looking at that biscuit right now that they hit. I'll probably say, let's see, um, just because I've watched a lot of videos. Let's see, I would say maybe um, Texas, bro. You know what I'm saying? That's probably the best place. You get the munchies, bro. I'll be in heaven. I'll be like, this. 
downtown Austin, Texas. You know what I'm saying? That's probably got the best food right now. <laughs> <laughs> How to beast? Because I was getting tackles from there. You know what I'm saying? No, I won't make it too obvious. Let me see a play. Yeah, put the camera down. You know you can't be playing. You know. Oh, that's a nice TV, bro. That's massive, too. He's not here playing. He's not playing. I don't even like that TV myself. You know what I'm saying? I live in Bubba Show. <laughs> These niggas are playing 2K in a Bubba Show. Oh my God. I don't know. Is that a Bubba Show? Who is this playing? No, maybe that's interesting. Got him. Hey. Making bold moves. Hey, notice how 2K is so bad, bro. That this is like the only like fun mode that you can play with against people and shit, bro. Bro, Ronald and Mike Wayne are official bums, bro. Like y'all are bum ass niggas for real. <laughs> Go to hell, man. This is the only mode that you can play with just like a casual, like you know what I'm saying, like quick match and shit. That's sad, bro. It used to be you could run up the quarters and everything. Niggas don't even want to play a regular game. That's my son. I said no, cash fans. He's coming to talk. I need to get him in. Yes. Wait, that's Cash Nasty, bro. Here it is, and they're in podcast. <laughs> These niggas doing podcasts. Let's go, man. You know what I'm saying? What should I ask you about? He said, I want to do some podcasts. It's real weird. It does a bunch of workouts. We need to ask him, like, how he works out. So, I can work out, Cash Nasty. I mean, it's just a somewhat, you know, street diet, you know, wake up, have a clean breakfast, you know, eggs. Guys, make sure you subscribe if you're brand new. You drop a like right now, man. It helps. The channel helps more people see the videos, you know what I'm saying? But it do flight crew. Oh, what the fuck? Did I just... Oh, no. Dude, I, I, I accidentally pressed uh, the button, so it skipped backwards. Oh, we're back. And he's like, he's friends with Jess Heard all day. And I said, what's well, we up to him? He said, I think so. Speaking right now. Wait, I think we're up to here. Yeah, it's all good. know what time it is. We are outside the Memphis Grizzly Arena. The Lakers and the Memphis Grizzly about to go down in a couple hours. Speaking right now. Yeah, let me Eastern get something to eat real quick. For the game. We are in front of the Memphis Arena. The game hasn't even started. The city is crunk. No. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What you know about that crunk, really? I've got some almonds, bro. Yo, this nigga is drinking, man. And this nigga was eating, man. It's me you want to eat. How do you continue to play at this It comes second nature. You know, uh, you know we, 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 we come here, we have a game plan, and then we just... We See, this nigga is drinking, man. You know what I'm saying? Next question. You're on track to get your 16th ring, your 16th season. What's the key to... Oh, 17th. Sorry, 17th. What's the key to your success? Bro, as an NBA player, I'd work on your quick. That's the key to success. NBA player, I would hate to do a press, especially if you lose, bro. You have to sit up there. You got, you literally have a script you have to read off of. And I don't know nothing about it. I don't know if they actually pre-write what they should say. But even still, bro, that's just, bro, you, you lose a game right quick, right? I'm pretty sure you probably have about like five or ten minutes to take a quick shower, bro. <laughs> and you got to be writing that interview and have like a perfect character in there. Uh, you got to give some NBA players a more credit, bro. Next question. Last, like, bro, last the other day. With the cup vote, like, bro, I'm surprised, bro, like, now looking right back at the interview, like, he actually held his own, like, and was very, very professional, bro. If that was me, bro, I would have flipped the whole microphone and stuff like that. <laughs> Which, what are we really talking about? So, excuse me? Why is this nigga just walking off? What's going on, man? What's going on? <laughs> Cash nasty. Wait, that's the Lebron. Bro, Cash, come on, bro. Nah, man, this better not be clickbait, bro. At this point, man. <laughs> what do I do, bro? <laughs> that better not be clickbait. <laughs>
Okay, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say. Mr. Beast, bro. I don't know what Real 
he had his fist brought up. And it wasn't probably because Cash was nervous. Because <laughs> I sometimes I'll do the same thing too. You know what I'm saying? It, like it, 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 like a first um, initiation thing, if it makes sense. Because I don't want people to be like, oh, like you, you might think my hands are dirty or anything like that. So it's like it's basically like a respect thing, bro. <laughs> Look at this. LeBron gave him a full dab. He's like, nah, fuck that. You give me a real dab. Oh! Yeah. This is history! <laughs> Look at this face, dude, bro. Look at this face, dude. Yes! Oh! <laughs> now, hey, I think LeBron, obviously they said that LeBron's known him, bro. That's so real, bro. I fuck with that shit so heavy, man. And I think they lost this game, too, right? Man, so much more respect, man. Yes, sir. So much more respect, man. Wow. Look at that, man. That's just inspirational. He had his fist balled out, and LeBron gave him the real dap, man. <laughs> Complete sports icon, man. LBJ just... Hey, that looks like Deontay Wilder. Deontay Wilder likes wearing rings like that, too, when, like, you know, so he's like Deontay Wilder. Probably the biggest W in your career, man. This is absolutely inspirational. You literally yes, just... You, and I hope you know... You literally shot ahead more further on the basketball rankings of all time. You know what I'm saying? Than a lot of um, uh, passing up all the players because of this moment right here, man. Just straight act of humbleness, man. Amazing. Wow, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him. He looks like a little kid, bro. <laughs> wow, man. <laughs> Look at him, man. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> If that was Curry, bro, I'd just honestly chop my hand off and just frame it, fam. <laughs> There's no way hell I'll watch it ever again. Dude, that's history, bro. Shout out, bro. Shout out to the dude. Come on, YouTube, bro. Shout out, YouTube. Come on, YouTube. Come on, YouTube. Give me up. Work out. Hey. 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 I never really thought of that. Memphis and Louisiana do have similar accents. It's like they're kind of like lost cousins. That's interesting. Even like, is this like the city of Memphis? Because I've never been to Memphis before. Like, I've been to Tennessee, but not Memphis. Wait, Memphis is a state or that's Tennessee, right? Anyway, but bro, this literally looks like Mardi Gras a little bit, kind of. But like, more of like, less packed. Hey, thank you. Is that Gideon? Hey, man, thank you so much, Gideon. I haven't washed my hand yet. It is. That's hand. Gideon. Premium. <laughs> okay, we're just going to ask how we can hear that. Hey, man, shout out to Cash, man. It finally happened. Uh, hopefully, man, him and LeBron can probably get some content or a vlog or something like that after the season is over, man. Very inspirational. Just shows, man. I guess never stop pursuing your dream to meet somebody. This can always be popular. Yes, sir. I really hope you did enjoy, guys. If you're still watching, make sure you subscribe. I'll catch you on the next video. I love you all. Make sure you check out my other videos, too. And I'm out. Peace.